So I decided that since my hair is behaving quite nicely, it's vacation, and I haven't done one of these in like forever, I decided that I'm gonna do one about prom. I'm going to talk to you because this is really awkward. Like, I have to get used to talking in front of a camera again because I haven't done it in so long. As you may have noticed, or may not, because nobody watches these videos except for like me and like four, three people. There's a change in scenery. I'm standing this up because I'd like to show you my prom dress and I can't do that when it's over there. And look in this mirror, you can see me like creeping. <laughs> That's nice. I went prom dress shopping with my friend Gabby. I'll post a link to her in the bottom in case some random person I don't know decides to watch this. This is the liquid eyeliner. As you can see, I've been trying to figure out how to work it. I'm not very good yet, so my makeup is always, like, looks terrible. This is actually the best job I've done so far. So anyways, as you three people that watch my videos, as you guys know, and a lot of other people that I know know this, I'm going to prom. <laughs> oh my god! And I got this, this lovely dress, and I'm going to model it for you so everyone can see what I'm going to wear like three dimensions because I posted a picture I don't know if everyone saw it I hope so I posted the picture on Facebook hoping that no one would get it and I did get it at a very popular store known as a uh, JC Penney's I really hate that I get a lot of my clothes there but they have some nice stuff and I mean it wasn't the only store that I could have gotten the dress at like I went to this Deb store or whatever and they had like this whole like, half the store was dedicated to prom dresses. I was looking at one on there, and it was, like, yellow, and it was, like, long, because it's prom, and I want to wear a long dress. And yellow is, like, my absolute favorite color. So, I wanted that one, and I tried it on, but sm the biggest size they had was, like, too small for me. And it was kind of upsetting, because I really wanted the dress. But, whatever, I guess. I found one that I like even more. I'm, like, in love with it. And that's good. <laughs> I was creeping through my boyfriend's pictures on Facebook. Like, pictures of him that people have tagged him in. And then I found this one from Winter Carnival. And, like, this girl was just, like, a piece of her in my picture. And I was like, whoa, that's really weird. Her dress looks like mine, only it's blue. So then I was like, wait, I think she's wearing the same dress that I got. So then I creeped through all her pictures. And it turns out she did get the same exact dress as me, only hers is blue, and I look better in it, obviously. I had to get, like, a size that was, like, two sizes bigger than my normal size. It's whatever, because I look good in it, so I don't care if I have to get, like, a size 40 plus sizes. If it looks good on me, it looks good on me, and that's what I do. I don't care. I'm not gonna cram myself into a size 5, just so I can say that my dress is a 5. I have no life. Subway. Awesome. I have to re-dye my hair. Like, you can see my roots really bad. I don't know if you can in this light. I'll do this so you can see, like, like, right here. I don't know how well you can see that, but my roots are growing in. So I bought some new dye. I've always grown up thinking, like, kitten heels are gross and, like, ugly. Because one of my friends, when I was, like, seven years old, was like, oh my god, kitten heels are, like, they're ugly. And I was like, what are those? And, like, really short heels. And I was like, oh my god, those sound really ugly. So I kind of, like, was brainwashed since I was little. La, la. But I got some really cute ones at that Deb store where I was planning to get my dress. Size 9. It's a good size. It's a good size. Yeah, I just love how, like, simple they are. And, like... I love the heel because they're really comfortable to walk in, which is awesome. Like, the only complaint I have is that right here, it's, like, it hurts the ball of my feet, but it's probably because, like, this is so thin, there's not really any padding, but I can just get, like, gel things for them. But, like, they're so cute. They're, like, simple and springy, and they're, the heel isn't, like, ridiculously high, they're, so they're pretty practical, and I could wear them, like, after prom, like, just around. Which is awesome because I love to wear my shoes more than one time because I'm that kind of person. And the heel is nice and short, so it's like not like freaky like, mm, Lady Gaga, no. And I'm not gonna be taller than my boyfriend because I wouldn't want that. Because I don't know, that's I'm just that kind of girl. I don't want to be taller than my boyfriend because I'm 
classy. So, time to show you my dress. <laughs> I'm naked! Just kidding. This is my dress, and it's too long because I have the shortest legs in the world. But yeah. So nice. It's like a nice corally color. Oh my goodness. So nice. It's kind of big. Like, I'm probably gonna get it tailored like right here so that it, not that tight, but like tight enough so that it stays up. I actually have to like, these things, I don't think they're straps, but I have to wear them as straps because right now it is too big. And it's too long, so I have to walk like this. I'm like, oh, hi guys, prom. And I just, oh, I feel bad after, because like, I don't want to get rid of it. I just want to keep this forever, even though I'd never wear it again. And it's so nice. I'm gonna look gorgeous. While I was adjusting these straps, my nipple slipped out, and I'm gonna edit that out. So I just wanted to let you guys know what you're missing. And uh, my aunt's coming over Saturday to uh, sew up these sides so that I can not have to use the straps. And probably hem the bottom because it's too long and I keep tripping over it because I have the shortest legs in the world. But whatever, they're awesome. My legs are awesome. Do my little twirly thing. I hate how terrible this lighting is because it's an awesome dress, but you can't really see it. 